Hey everybody, welcome back to my Project 13. Thanks for coming on by and checking out this product review video. Appreciate your time and your support. Want to give a huge welcome and shout out to Spigen. Welcome to Team My Project 13. This is an exciting moment for me. For some time now, I've been wanting to be a part of Team Spigen, and it has happened. Hey Anthony, so happy to be connected with you. Yay to new friends. Did my best to pack everything in one box. Added our fan favorites like the Enzo Aramid and the Zero One. Hope you enjoy Stella. Stella, thank you so much. Looking forward to working with you for quite some time. And for those of you that want to stay connected with Spigen, you got many different social media platforms right there. Now what I'm going to do is review one case today and that's going to be for the Google Pixel Fold. So I'm going to put this aside and you're just going to have to stay tuned to check out all of these case reviews that will be coming your way as quick as I can get them out. Yeah, baby, yeah. All right, let's check out the packaging for the Slim Armor Pro for the Google Pixel Fold. Hard polycarbonate material, soft TPU, hybrid polymorph technology, air cushion technology, all four corners are going to help cushion your pixel fold if you were to drop it on the ground. Semi-auto sliding technology and a lot more information. So please read everything. And I love the way that just slides out like that. Very nice presentation here from Spigen. And this is the back part of the case and you do have hinge protection. And you have the frame of the case. And you get some extra adhesive strips. You have this installation guide on how to remove the adhesive strips that currently exist on the frame of the case and how to replace them. So please read everything. Here we got a close up of the frame with the pre-installed adhesive strips. Right up on the corner there, you got this little film tab you're gonna pull away and expose the adhesive there. And you have an adhesive strip right in here as well. Film tab right there that you're going to pull away as well. And at the bottom there. It, there is no built-in screen protector. I do have a tempered glass screen protector on my Google Pixel Fold. So what we want to do is peel away protective film over those adhesive strips. Just like that. And give your Pixel Fold a really, really nice wipe down. Okay. And we're going to put that on my Google Pixel Fold. And you wanna press down so the adhesive sticks to the Pixel Fold right along here as well, the back part of the frame and right in here. All right, let's put the back part of the case on. That went on very nice and simple. You can see that we have a lot of lip surrounding the camera bar area and some depth going on there. So setting down on a flat surface or if the surface is a little bit rough, you are good to go. Anything rougher than that, I would use your discretion. I would probably invest in a camera glass protector for that area. The power button that doubles up as the fingerprint reader and your volume rocker nicely exposed. A lot of space to utilize those areas. You'll have no issues whatsoever. Up top, cut out for your speaker grill and a cut out for the top mic. At the bottom, one, two, three, little cutouts there for the bottom mics, huge cutout for the USB Type-C charging port, and we have a cutout there for the bottom speaker grill. 
on the hinge protection there, you got the Spigen brand name. You can see that we have this very nice looking textured traction grip going on there. Feels really, really good in the palm of my hand. This case is nice and grippy, folks. On the inside, let's get a little wipe down here. Case surrounds the outer inner display there. The case itself just runs smoothly into the inner display. You don't want any lip on the inside because then it wouldn't close the way it's supposed to. So that, that just looks really, really nice. It's really, really good to see that it comes in though a bit to protect as it flows right into the display area there. Yeah, I am digging that. The lip, plenty of it protecting the AMOLED display. I have the tempered glass cream protector. So a lot of protection going on there on a flat surface surface is a little bit rough. Even if the surface is really rough, the worst you could do is damage your tempered glass cream protector. Uh, if you're going to sport a film protector, please use your discretion. But no issues with the frame and the tempered glass cream protector. Last but not least, wireless charging. Boom, just like that. Any questions, please ask down below in the comment section. All the information to purchase the Slim Armor Pro from Spigen, that'll be down below in the description area and I'll leave a link for the tempered glass screen protector as well. But I gotta tell you, man, this is sleek and bold. Definitely going to protect my investment. Once again, huge shout out to Spigen. Welcome to Team My Project 13. Thanks for the opportunity. And with that, God bless. Peace. I'm out.